This is your first time trying German beer, right? Yes, to my knowledge, yes. Yeah. Hey! You guys obviously saw the poll on my YouTube channel. I asked you guys if you wanted me to vlog a very interesting experience that we're probably gonna be doing today. I mean, we're definitely about to do it like right now. So apparently in Pensacola, they're hosting this halfway to Oktoberfest thing and she found it. <laughs> So we're about to head up there and check it out and kind of give you the whole rundown. I know a lot of you guys said it was going to be cringe, super typical, and blah, blah, blah. But we got to check it out for ourselves and see if it's any of those things. Smash that like button right now before you watch anything else. Because I'm going to be doing a lot more outdoorsy things. There's another town that I found that's like a small little Bavarian village in Georgia too. And that'll be a vlog for later. But I feel like you guys will like that as well. Because there's a lot of things I didn't realize America does to kind of like feed into the German culture a lot and stuff like that. So, uh... Yeah, let's not waste any time. Gotta love Florida's unpredictable weather. I swear to God, it's like, you know, 90 degrees one day and then 50 degrees the next. I know none of you guys know what that means because it's Fahrenheit. Um, so in Celsius, let's just say it's like 30 degrees one day and then 12 degrees the next. That's Florida in a nutshell. In case you guys didn't know that, welcome to Northern Florida. And also, welcome to chivalry. It's not dead. We're here. So um, I guess this is the place. It looks pretty... German-ish, I guess. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Oh, shit. <laughs> what you, oh, oh, this? Yeah, my back. <laughs> oh. So I'll show you guys what this looks like. This looks super, like, cute. Look. <laughs> so up here, they have it. It says, like, beer garden, like, in German and stuff. Like, look at that. <laughs> And then, like, they have like, a whole these festivities and stuff, man. This looks pretty cool. What the heck? This is cool. So I guess, like, you could try that out. Like, oh yeah. Be in the jar. When I counted out his money, it paid off. Right, so they can order some beer, and I think they have five German beers on tap. So we're gonna try them out and see how like legit they are. We're gonna see if we can get a flight. Taste test them and whatnot. Mm. This is nice. <laughs> this is like the beer. So cool. It's a winery too, so it's pretty safe. You also got some German beers, just so you know, outside. That's super cool. I think so. But I didn't pay that much attention when I went out there. I should have. We have like five. There's like the Eyinger in Germany, I think. Yeah, Eyinger in Germany. It's all good. Is that also a German beer as well? I guess. Yeah, we'll get that too. So I guess we're gonna find a place to try this and whatnot. Um, there's apparently another, I guess, place we can get more beer and stuff over in, I think, that area over there, like right by the food truck. Wait, did you have German beer last time? Or no? Oh. Light to darkness. Yeah. That's so sick. Okay. Alright, so which one? So that's the Hefe, uh, Hefe uh, Weiss beer. So we're gonna try, she's gonna try that one first. And this is your first time trying German beer, right? Yes, to my knowledge. Yes. Hey, that, that could be a title. That's a title right there. Let's go. Alright, so let's see. I'm gonna try not to get my lipstick on. You can get your lipsticks on anything. Oh man, let's go. Oh, you like good. it? Hey! Oh. I feel like you would like that. It's okay. I'm not a, a huge light beer fan, but it's it's pretty good. Better than Bud Light, so. <laughs> this one is actually this brewery's version of a double Belgium, I think is what she said. So this yeah. is Stumbling Monk. So this is a local take on a Belgian beer. Oh, wow. So that's not a German beer, that's a Belgian beer. <laughs> Basically Germany sideways. Yeah. On a scale of 1 to 10, how would you rate that? Maybe a 5. It's pretty mid, that's it mid. It almost tastes like... Really? It has like a sweet coffee aftertaste. So at first it kind of has like a beer taste, and then like the aftertaste is like a sweet, like coffee kind of. It's weird. Okay, this one's Dark Helmet. I don't particularly love 
a dark beer, except for sometimes an occasional Guinness. So we'll see. I'm the occasional Guinness. <laughs> Ooh. I don't know. Oh no. You, she doesn't like it. She doesn't like dark beer. All right. So come on, you jolly young fellows. Oh my I'll god. Take one and buy me. Now that's a beer. That's We're so fucking good. Yeah, you're not drinking any more of this? No. You, are not able to you already know the vibes, guys. Bottoms up. Oh. Now this one. The Ayinga. Ayinga um, Celebrator. It's from Ayinga, Germany. And, um, boom. Am I saying that right? Ayinga? Ayinga, Ignore Germany. Ignore my handwriting. Hold on. Ayinga Celebrator. It's it from Ayinga, Germany, or Ayinga. Eyeing Germany, I I Einger, Einger. I don't know. I think it's Einger. I think it looks cool. Like your this one is hey, thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> oh oh man, London. tear up. All right, you ready? Okay, yeah, I already said some. Let's go. This one tastes like this one. Yeah. But more flavor. Like this one almost oh, tastes God. like it doesn't have enough flavor. Like it's watery, oh, but this one know. tastes. I don't know. You taste it. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's it see. tastes the same, but not as like stronger flavor. Oh my God! It smells sweet. It tastes like a cider. Uh, no, it doesn't. It does a little bit. Like what? Like coffee cider? <laughs> it tastes like coffee apple juice with beer in it. That's the best way I can describe. Like coffee apple juice beer. It's crazy, right? Now we got here a little bit late, but earlier they had right behind. Me. They're trying to see who, like, I guess could toss that keg the farthest. Your boy's gonna enter that shit. It's too late. Too late. It's also too late because there's a Stein toss, I think, or hoist or something. Oh. Right there, you see there's Steins filled with water. We're about to see this shit. Uh, do they already do it? I heard I think it's, done. it's done? It's starting at it did start at six. Which beer was your favorite? Which German beer? Okay, so she likes the, uh, oh my god. Hefe Weissbier. Heffinger, Heffinger, something. I'm a, I think it's a Heffinger. Um, Weissbier, if I'm saying that wrong, let me know in the comments down below. What's your favorite beer? And what's the worst beer in Germany? I, I need to know that. Uh, you guys pride yourselves on having the best beer because of your, like, purity laws out there and blah, blah, blah. But what is the worst beer in Germany? Beer that makes you say, Bleh. you know what I mean? Like, I, I, I gotta know. So out of all the ones that I've tried, I think this last one was my favorite. This last one was really good. I mean, to me. I like dark beer, man. I'm like, obsessed. I, the, the more bitter that shit is, better. You know what I mean? Also, I heard that your beers like, don't give you guys hangovers. That's like a rumor, but I heard that like, you can drink as much German beer as you want and you'll never have a hangover. I think that's a lie, but you let me know in the comments down below. So, they got like, people in Durndal and like, later hosts know, obviously you guys should call that too. It's super cool. Um, it's like, Bavarian theme, which I think Oktoberfest is, right? Oktoberfest is more of a Bavarian like thing, or is it all? It's all over Germany, though. I thought. This is so cool. Yeah. yeah, yeah, for YouTube. So I do like uh, German content and stuff okay, like that. Cool. So like I figured like, since you guys have like an Oktoberfest thing going on, like I can kind of film like uh, my experience here and everything. I've never been to Germany, so this is the closest I can get to. <laughs> I appreciate it. Uh, 438,000. No way. Yeah. Yeah. Holy cow. Yeah. How long did it take you to build that up? Oh, uh, like two, three years and stuff. Did it? Like, yeah. I, 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 hey, salute, bro, because... I appreciate like, it. Like, my sister-in-law, my brother-in-law, they had a farm, and, uh, like, I'm Gary's son-in-law, right? So this is all family. I'm a wife. This is so cool. So we're all family. I'm, my wife and I's kids work here. But anyway, yeah. they tried doing it. They had a collie farm, and they've got horses. They did it for, like, two months, and it was so hard. Like, oh, the, the editing, and, the, yeah. you know, and then they, they get very few views, and it was so discouraging. So the fact that you... Oh, it, it's... Right now, YouTube Shorts is the thing. So, like, if you guys want to start again, like, um, you'll blow up really fast posting YouTube Shorts and stuff. No, not the Miss Constant. It's against me conscience to run you a flat race. I'm afraid you're too small. You can't make the grade. She said I may be small, but yet I'll take on any runner when the track is wet. Bam. Is it the big I'm 
have a little job. So this performer, I heard him say that he started playing, he said, this is another Irish song because I know it's Irish Day, or I know it's German Day, but I don't know any German songs. I mean, but who does, honestly? I don't know how any German It's just funny that, like, he's like, Irish is close enough. <laughs> Literally. The whole vibe is so nice. I like it. It's very, like, welcoming. There's families here. Um, everybody's having a good time. The restaurant closed at, like, 5, so I wish we could have tried some of the food there. We will be back. We definitely will be back. This is such a cool place. So for anybody that wants a German vibe and is in America but can't really get that vibe because they can't go to Germany and they want to get that vibe, you need to go to this spot. It's called Gary's Beer Garden and Brew House. I listened to the GPS, what he just said, at least four times before we left. He was like, I don't know why it's not pulling up because it's Gary's Brewery and Beer Garden, not Brew House. When the last lap started, I was a feeling suspended. Damn. They have like a Greek food place here, which is pretty cool, I guess. You know, every... Not, not always. Just for the event tonight, they're hosting this, which is interesting because they do have some German food they serve on their own, but they close their kitchen at 5.30 today rather than 9 when they close. So mm. look at the sunlight coming in on me right now. Yeah, it's nice, right? Look at that. Oh, dang. Dang. Look at that. Look at that beer. Okay. Oh. Oh, no, 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 look at that, that beer. Oh, man. We're going to end off the night with cinnamon rolls, by the way. My mother wants to Look at that. Say what's up. Hey. <laughs> Mama, I'm famous. It was an ice cream truck. You're actually full. So, literally, um, I'm about to do this Stein hoist. This is the most, like, German thing I think I've done here, like, in America, dog. So, uh, wish me luck. Let's go. Look at my beautiful wife. Isn't she so fucking beautiful? Look at that. Oh. Oh my gosh. And then boom. Um, oh, oh, oh. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> That's enough. And then this is like the tuna um, pita. This is this is Greek food, so don't get it twisted. This is not German food. But um, I'm, I signed up for two events um, that they have here. They have a keg toss and they have a stein hold. I have to hold the, the stein in front of me for as long as, as possible. Dude, I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to dominate both these competitions, man. So we're gonna do like this uh, keg toss thing. The kegs are right there, and like that's what they look like. So, and basically the objective is to throw them as far as possible. So from this line to like as far over there as possible. You know, I'm gonna see if I got it. You know, my wife's gonna record. There she is, cameraman. Let's go. Ah. The thing looks heavy. Good job! Alright. You don't know There it is. Woo! You got it? Yeah. Okay, for sure. Yeah, you got it. Oh wow. Oh. Oh, he's got it. Oh, shit. Oh! Wow! Like... Is that a talk? Oh, dang! Good. <laughs> All right, you got it. There it is. Got it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it dug deep in there. Oh my god. There it is. Woo! Hey, there you go. <laughs> Oh, 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 my God. Yep. Yeah. Oh, nice. Another contender. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! <laughs> we'll, we'll count it down, and basically, you're gonna, like I told you before, we're gonna hold it out like this. 
No thumbs on the top, just basically a grip. You can hold it out as far as you can go. So uh, if you guys are ready to go, we'll go ahead and start it down in five, four, three, two, one. I'm gonna take 